Why has GTA Online been so successful? What are GTA Online's downsides? And what will Rockstar do to make GTA 6 Online even more of a success? These are the questions I want to answer in this video and really understand what platform's success GTA Online will be when GTA 6 will release. If you do like this series where I review games that are new, old, coming up, make sure you drop a follow and comment if you think I've got it right or have missed anything. Now, let's get into the video. Why has GTA Online been so successful? GTA Online was launched by Rockstar Games in 2013 and it quickly became one of the most popular online multiplayer games of all time. With a player count that has consistently remained high throughout the years, it is clear that GTA Online has a resounding success. One of the primary reasons for GTA Online's success is the open world environment. It features a massive map and is full of activities for players to engage in. Players can customise their characters, purchase properties, participate in a variety of missions and heists. The game's open world design allows players to explore the map at their leisure, creating a sense of freedom and immersion that is difficult to replicate in other games. Another reason for the game's success is its depth of content. Over the years, Rockstar Games has developed numerous updates and expansions to the game, adding new vehicles, weapons, missions and game modes. This has kept the game fresh and exciting, giving players a reason to return to the game time and time again. Additionally, the game's community has created their own content, such as custom maps, game modes, further extending the game's replayability. GTA Online's social features have also played a significant role in its success. The game allows players to form crews and join together to complete missions and heists. This encourages social interaction, creating a sense of camaraderie and teamwork among players. Additionally, the game's voice chat feature allows players to communicate with one another in real time making the game feel more immersive and social. The game's economy system has also contributed to its success. Players earn in-game currency by completing missions and selling stolen goods, which they can then purchase vehicles, properties and other such items. This creates a sense of progression and accomplishment, motivating players to continue to play the game. Additionally, the game's microtransaction system allows players to purchase in-game currency with real money, giving them a shortcut into acquiring games items. GTA 9 has a constant updates and support from Rockstar, which has helped to maintain the game's success. The developers have been responsive to player feedback, addressing bugs and balancing issues in a timely manner. Additionally, the developers have released regular updates and content expansions, ensuring that the game remains fresh and exciting for players. What problems has GTA Online faced? Whilst the game has enjoyed tremendous success since its release in 2013, it has also faced several issues and problems that have impacted the player experience. One of the biggest problems of GTA Online is its prevalence of modders and hackers. Modders are players who use third-party software to modify game files, allowing them to cheat and gain an unfair advantage over other players. Hackers who use software exploits to manipulate the game and gain an unfair advantage. These players can ruin the game experience for others and their actions have a major source of frustration in the community. GTA Online also suffers from connective issues whilst players experience frequent disconnections and server issues. This can be particularly frustrating during missions or events, as players lose progress or rewards due to server problems. The game's matchmaking system can also be unreliable, with players often being matched from one another with the same skill level who have different playing styles. Another problem with GTA Online is the prevalence of griefers and trolls. These players intentionally disrupt the gameplay experience for others, often by killing other players or destroying their vehicles. This behaviour can be particularly frustrating for new players who are still learning the game and it can discourage them from continuing to play. Whilst the game has received regular updates in the early years, the pace of updates has slowed down significantly with some players feeling the game has become stale. This has led to a decline in the player base with some more players moving over to other games. What should Rockstar do to make GTA 6 Online a success? In order to make GTA 6 Online a success, Rockstar will need to review the current GTA Online model they will need to take some of the key elements that have been a success. However, Rockstar cannot overlook the GTA RP circuit, which has had a great hand in the continued love for GTA. For those of you who aren't aware, GTA RP is a multiplayer mod for Grand Theft Auto V. It enables players to assume specific roles within games in the virtual world and interact with other players in a role-playing format. In GTA RP, players create their own character, complete with unique personality traits, physical attributes and backstory. Once their character is created, they are free to interact with the virtual world and other players in whatever they choose. For example, a player might choose to become a police officer, a criminal mastermind, 
or even a civilian trying to navigate their way through the city. The beauty of GTA RP is it allows players to immerse themselves in a virtual world where anything is possible. Players can create their own stories, engage in realistic interactions with other players and building relationships with characters and meet along their way. The mod also features a variety of different activities for players to participate in, including everything from car races, heists, or even mundane activities like shopping or sightseeing. When GTA Online was launched, it was also mentioned of having these abilities, working with particular segments such as police or within the government. As the GTA RP circle was so successful, GTA 6 Online does need to take learnings from this and implement into the new online model. Examples of these could be enabling character jobs, it doesn't only immerse players further into the GTA Online game, but it also takes forward the innovation that the modding community has brought to the table. GTA RP does come with its flaws. Being a modded game, there are flaws which can easily be rectified with in-game coding, such as access to buildings and player development and jobs. If you're looking forward to GTA 6, please check out my video that should appear in the top right hand side now on the screen, as it will show the current state of GTA 6 and what has been released so far. My final thoughts. In conclusion, GTA Online's success can be attributed to a combination of factors, including its unique gameplay, immersive world, ongoing support from developers, and strong community of players. The game has managed to keep players engaged and entertained for years, and its continued popularity is a testament to the quality of the game and the dedication of the developers. However, with serious hacker issues and modern issues have made the platform unstable. We are looking forward to GTA 6 and hoping that GTA 6 Online version can also include key elements of GTRP to create a more immersive environment where the character has a greater responsibility that in turn could reduce some of the flaws of GTA Online. Finally, thank you all for watching. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Make sure you drop a like and comment anything that you think I have missed and have a great day.